It's a diffuser, so it's basically like put essential oils in it, these kind of things. And then it basically like bubbles it and then disperses it in the air as vapor. All of these do something different, like lavender is like supposed to relax you, orange is supposed to be for headaches and migraines. Yeah, they all have different effects. Back in the day, they, everyone wanted to get like uh, the Last Supper. You can imagine how much shitty, crazy, fucking dumbass detail is in that thing, right? And I'd be telling them, I'm like, bro, the same amount of work and effort and time that I'm gonna put into doing like all these tiny little faces and stuff, like I bet you you'd be way happier if we spent our time doing this and then you feel like you get something out of it because it's gonna take me two sessions just to get this tiny, I mean, this one little space there. Last supper's detail. Each body, different shapes. Dude, it's ridiculous. Like each of those characters have a little mouth that's like tiny, a little eye socket, a little nose. You gotta tattoo that. It doesn't just like happen. I think a lot of people think we tattoo with magic wands. <laughs> and they're like, oh a rose, that's just a rose. And I'm like, bro, we gotta tattoo that rose. It actually has to get done with a needle. Not like I just it's there. Respect your tattoo artist. Maybe we just kind of put, put like the D&D &E over here, kind of put it inside. It'd be tight to actually incorporate this rope thing. Yeah. And be super tight because it would just like add to that kind of theme or whatever. Yeah. And then if we do the uh, 45, it probably lands somewhere over here or it's kind of one of those things that I wanted to put it all on first and then get the vibe of it. Yeah. But this is what I was talking about, like any any place that there's like a little gap, like I could do these like lines, dotted lines, yeah. make a little island and stuff. And then yeah. when you shade it, it gives off like that map feel, you know what I mean? Yeah. But, uh, I like it a lot. Okay, good, good, good. I think the hardest part was just trying to like figure out like designing this side, but designing it to where we could also get that rose done still. Yeah, yeah, So yeah. it's kind of like, I'm probably gonna start with this side first because we wanna keep the ongoing of the leg around. Yes. And because the rose over here is just to like cap off. Yeah. This is actually a part of your bottom leg, so you know what I mean? Yeah. So we'll start with this and then uh, move on to the rose near the end of it. Perfect. Cool? Uh, yeah, that works really nice. I actually already started like destiny and stuff, so I'm almost ready already. I already stenciled some stuff. Perfect, thank you, I appreciate yep. it. Chris Brown. <laughs> what, you don't like watching Chris Brown? Move? I do, let me see. Watch out. <laughs> Why are you doing something? You know what else there? Oh. Oh. Ooh. Can you see that? No. Fucking bitch. Don't talk to me. That's how you get into that paper out of there. Oh yeah, that was smooth. <laughs> okay. I wait and You heard that she impressed. <laughs> <laughs> Alright guys. Number one rule to impress a lady. Number one rule to impress a lady. You better have a shot like Kobe. Because when you shoot you better make it. And have an out toy. Life lessons with shine. Now if only I could take my own advice. I literally made this essential without knowing if this is the right size or not. I'm all over the place. I would usually go make sure it's the right size. But now I'm gonna be like, whoa, all confident and shit.
Yeah. Let's go take uh, yeah. put these on. Right. Or so Okay, there we go. You're the only one in today? Yes, sir. Lazy fucks, no blame. Yeah. Totally good. Devon had eye surgery. Oh, really? Yeah. Shit. It went good. He's just recovering now. No pressure, though, right? When you get something done like that serious on something that's like you use for your living. Yeah, like your career. That's fucking crazy. Yeah, tattooing, you don't get no benefits at all. You gotta set them up yourself. Do you like what, 401k or something? I don't really want to do that. I don't really care to do that. Just yeah. Because if I play my cards right, even just in a couple years, you know, I'll mm -hmm. be able to retire off like residuals. 401k is cool if you're trying to save your way to being well off. Yeah. But there's a way to like earn your way to being well off. Oh, yeah. You going on any trips again? We just went to, what did I do since, since last time you were here? You were, you went to LA. Yeah, we went to New York and then we went to LA and then we went to LA again. Oh shit. Yeah, we did a bunch of trips since last time you were here. About to go to Hawaii next week. Yeah, for vacation or? Vacation. This is the first vacation trip I've ever taken. Yeah. yeah. Are you excited? So, we're just gonna say yes. We're just gonna say the house. Are you and Courtney in or what? Me and Courtney? I mean, you and Sheena. Are you and Courtney in? Are you and Courtney in or what? Are you and you in? Are you and you going on or what? Oh, yeah, seriously, they feel like we just have a playoff. I right? love like, my sleep. Like, I will kill for my sleep. Yeah, I do too. And then when it gets to nighttime and people are like, oh, it's fucking uh, I'm like, <laughs> when we're like out on trips, I'd be trying not to be that guy, but like near the end of the day, I'm just like, you guys still wanna do, huh? <laughs> But there is a side of me that fights that side that's like super overactive that wants to go do like bro you ever did a midnight hike through the woods but then my other side is like bro what are you talking about just smoke that blunt go to sleep wake up go have breakfast see that's fucked up because i'm like let's smoke the blunt and then go on the midnight hike oh hell no yeah i can't get high and fucking no yeah go do hella active shit <laughs> i don't even like being in public high at all like don't worry guys, exist. I'll make sure I'm high enough for all of us. I and mean, you're like peer pressure, you're like, can I hit this? And I'm like, I no. I am not peer pressure. <laughs> no, no vision. No visual. No visual. No visual. Yeah.